Hey, this is the Big Hardcore Gamer, and in this video, I'm going to be playing Leap, which is a new multiplayer game that was released on the 1st of March. Now, I received a um, review code from Key Mailer and um, Blue Hour Studios, so thank you for providing me with that. Um, so, what I'm going to be doing. I already played through the um, tutorial last night and there are two modes. Um, first one pretty much like a um, like a horde mode kind of thing and then you've got PvP. So I'm going to be playing both of those modes in this video and um, see what they're like. Let's start off with the special operations. So I've got a assault rifle and a shotgun. Bertie. Was that incendiary grenades? Stick grenade, put grenade. Okay, so as I level up, I'll get these. Ultimate airstrike. And our other board to move around with. Alright, so, okay, so overshields, so start overshields. Uh, starting overshields are 100% larger. Regenerating PV, so passively regenerate your shields while using your personal vehicle. Okay, escape artist, so reduce the cooldown of your personal vehicle by 50%. Okay, I'm gonna stick with the one I've already got at the moment. Now it's radar, so increase your radar by 50%. Will increase max target range for off the grappling hook range. You know what? Let's go with that one. Seems like I might be a bit more useful. Uh, nothing available yet. Tough and uh, Titan. What's the difference? Oh, okay. A powerful and portable machine gun that fires small caliber ammunition. Um, trigger appy shooters. Beware, this weapon is prone to overheat. <coughs> Bring a rocket to gunfight. Ah, rocket launcher. Alright, alright, alright. So, what's this? A sniper class? Yeah, it is. What's the secondary? Oh, you get a sword. Got cloak and eye. Tech ops, what we got, what we got. So incendiary AI oh hold up. Incendiary assault rifle. That actually sounds sounds like my kind of thing. It's heavy duty assault rifle with uh skeletonized folding stick, slow to reload, but each shot packs a punch with deadly incendiary ammunition. I might have to go with that one, you know. The reconstructor projects a beam that heals friendly soldiers vehicle. Eh. <laughs> Alright, not this time, not this time. I, I just want to kill, I don't want to heal. <laughs> yeah, let's start with a Pathfinder, which basically seems like the standard assault class. Once operation starts, you won't be able to change the exosuit nor customize it. Make sure you have modified your exosuit to its first potential. Yeah. We'll just go straight in. Hello. You in the headset, bro? Come on now, dog. Come on, man. I really am just doing the shit with my, with my ones, aren't I? Okay, cool. Yeah. 
Yeah, I need to take a little, a little bit of cover, man. Oh shit, got a lot coming in for me. Alright, come. Spec Ops is kind of fun. I ain't gonna lie. Where's the last guy? Oh. Oh, there you are. Thank you. Scan suggest additional threats imminent. Defeat all incoming hostiles. I suppose the thing with this is going to be whether you're okay with um, with playing the horde mode by yourself, because people will just duck out and leave you to it if you're not at high, high enough level. Randoms online can be complete scumbags, man. <laughs> complete scumbags. dealt with yeah this bounce I actually forgot about that shield. How many have I got? Oh, it's 22 to kill. <laughs> Send the airstrike. Dealt with. All of you. Recover all artifacts. Graphics look kind of nice in the um, in this mode. Oh shit!
Oh shit. <laughs> yeah, that was actually kind of fun. Oh wait, hold up. I didn't actually realize I've got I got teammates now. They must have joined the game in progress. All right, so let me request out. Come on, someone can help me out. Okay. <clears throat> so the Spec Ops mode is actually fun. I like that. So that is their, their Spec Ops. Now let's try the PvP. Oh, wait. Oh, uh. Oh, asset assassinations or tacticals of 20 players. Eliminate the enemy assets to score points while protecting your own. Okay. Mercenary, select your deploy point. That map seems kind of big. Are there actually enough um, players on it? <laughs> not even having actually filled up this squad, so... Hmm... We shall see. Okay. Oh, dear. this is a bit more sluggish compared to to the Spec Ops. As in, when it when it comes to aiming and shit, it's a bit. It feels a bit more sluggish. The aiming feels so slow. And if it, this is, it felt a lot better in the Spec Ops mode. A hell of a lot better. How many? Hold on a second. It's only, it's only six of us in the game. There's nobody playing this. Oh, I can actually. Oh, okay. I thought I had to stick to stick close to the ground, but I don't. The enemy has acquired a secret. Ah, oh, my days. That was my bad. That was my bad. Respawn time's kind of kind of long. <clears throat> it's a long respawn time. I didn't see nothing pop up on screen saying, you know, press this button to respawn. I do like this though. I like this. Uh, I like this overboard for getting around. That's that's kind of cool. Oh, it's my team. Yo, what's going on? Oh, spell. Oh, come on, man. I'm sure I shot dude in his face. The enemy 
has added tickets. Yo, this this match seems to be going on really long. Or is it just me? See, one of them's actually ducked out, one of them's had enough, which I'm kind of thinking of doing as well. <laughs> yeah, you see this? This moving around on the hoverboard? I like this. This is cool. Yeah, this 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 is really cool. Yeah, come to your death. <laughs> oh, you're still alive? Not anymore. Oh, I see. We've only got two. Uh, what is it? We've only got two tickets left. I, I, I don't. I don't know. I don't understand what's going on. Right. So we've only got two tickets. They got sixteen. So really, we should be about to lose. Let, 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 let me let me check something. Let me check something. I want to see what other multiplayer modes they have. Because maybe there's uh, more players in the other modes. So let's have a look. But there's no explanations of what each one is. Asset elimination, assassination is the one we just did, right? So let's just go with... Because I'm guessing that uh, Team Annihilation is probably Team Deathmatch. So let's go with that. Alright. Okay. No way. Alright. <laughs> let's, let's do them one by one, shall we? Okay, it's found one for control. Mercenary, select your deploy point. Though well, this seems kind of big. Again. Oh, okay, so basically just going after the three, three spots. All right. What? How's it put me into an empty? How's it put me into an empty match? Literally nobody playing this game. <laughs> oh my days! I'm 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 just I'm just gonna select them. I'm just gonna go for them out of curiosity. Now I want to see. I want I want to see. Um, what we got? Okay, so we've tried. We've done control. All right, let's try assault. Nobody playing. Okay, let's do capture the core. All right, we've got capture the core. Okay, let's see. Select your deploy point. Squad empty. All right, let's change teams. Empty. You know what? Nah, nah. Oh, hold on, that's with crossplay enabled. It's not even just against PC players. This is actually with crossplay enabled. Hold on, let me switch crossplay off. Let me see if it can just if it just finds PC players. Hold up. 
Let's see. No way. That's crazy. You know, let me let me let me let me quit this. All right. <laughs> <laughs> right, so the Spec Ops mode, that seems like it could be fun. To tell you the truth, Spec Ops mode, I could probably even play that by myself if, if need be, right? Um, it will be challenging though, because I was playing on bronze, which was the the um, the entry level. Um, it, it, it was the first difficulty and it was still challenging. So that, so that could be cool, right? But for the standard multiplayer, nobody's playing the damn game. <laughs> Nobody is playing the game. And the thing is, I haven't really seen it advertised. So I doubt anybody would be playing the frigging game. How much does this cost? Okay, so usual price would be twenty three seventy nine. Um half price at the moment, eleven eighty nine. Okay. <sighs> Now, I'm sure the developer, I'm sure like, um, what is it, Blue Hour, Hour Studios are, are watching videos for whoever's making content for them, right? So I've got to say this, right? Mm -hmm. Advertise the damn game. Because, I mean, literally, the day it released, it popped up. I must have seen one advert or so for it. Um, and that was before I actually saw that, I didn't actually really realize that it was being released. Because it actually looks like it could be cool. It looks like it could be cool. I do like um, the the movement on the other boards. Um, I like the um, the movement with the grappling hook as well. The, um, the the spec ops mode is fun. I actually like that. But the moment I switch to the uh, multiplayer um, to start off with, the maps are way too big. Um, unless you've got a lot of people playing, the maps are just way too big. You need some smaller maps in there, right? You need some smaller maps on smaller modes. And like I said, you need to advertise this game more, maybe put a demo out. Is there a demo out for this? Is there actually a demo out for this? Let's have a look. I, I don't see a demo out for this. I, maybe you need to put out a demo for it so people actually know about your game. Because uh, if I'm putting it this way, right? If I had actually paid for this game and I'd gone on and I was unable to find a match with anybody playing it, I'd be pissed and I'd be looking for a refund. All right, so this is what I'm going to, what I'm going to do, right? I am going to give it another two weeks. Yeah, yeah let's, let's say another two weeks, right? And then I'm going to go back in. I'm going to see if anybody is actually playing the game, if there's more players. If there are, then yeah, I might do another video. I might um, actually play through it, check out all the modes properly and maybe do a review. But as it is, there's there's not much me to do a review on. And the thing is, look at, look at the trailer. The trailer looks cool. The trailer looks really cool. See, if I'd seen this, actually, you know, this is actually what I saw, which is why I requested the um, the review code. This is what I, what I saw that actually got me interested in. But at the moment, it's it's just not it. Right, um, you need you need to do something to get more players on the game. <laughs> but yeah, anyway, um, but anyway, uh, thank you for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, or if you found it useful, um, leave it a like. Um, if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. Check out some other content. Uh, basically, this shows you that whether I get a code for free or not, I'm still gonna tell the truth. I honestly could not tell, could not recommend anybody you know, buys this game until they actually make some major changes to it. But anyway, I'm out. See you next time.